Hey everyone, James here, and welcome back to another day of VEDS. Now, some of you may remember last year during VEDS, I did a one-off sort of let's try of the Hocus Pocus 2 themed serial that came out before that movie dropped on Disney+. Plus. Now, I did intend for that to just be a one-off. That was until I found this. This is the Disney 100 Mickey Mouse Club Confetti Cake Cereal from Post that came out a couple, well, based on when I'm recording this, a couple months ago, but by the time I upload this, probably about half a year ago, around the time that they really started to push Disney 100. And so I figured, why not try it? There is another one that is more of a strictly Disney 100, not the Mickey Mouse Club theming. Uh, that one I think is just fruit, like a fruity flavored cereal. I would equivalate maybe to something like Fruity Pebbles, but uh, I haven't been able to get that one yet. So you will see it. I will cover it this month. But as of right now, I do not have it as of when I'm recording this. Now, I did learn my lesson from last year in that I already have it ready to go. But I will tell you, when I opened up the box, this thing claims it's like confetti cake. Uh, it definitely smells... Well, number one, it smells like sugar, but that's gonna happen. Uh, but it does kind of... It smells better. It, I will say, it has a... It has a very similar aroma strength to, I believe, the Hocus Pocus 2 cereal, which was a very... I think that was berry-themed. It was a berry-themed cereal. But whereas that one didn't taste like berries, it did smell like berries. Hopefully this one does kind of taste like what they're advertising. So, yeah. Let's watch the fat guy eat cereal. Okay, so first impressions. You can see it right there, kind of. I'll tilt this thing a little bit. Now, it does have the appearance of Kix, for those of you who remember Kix. That definitely has a very strong taste. I don't quite know if I would say that is confetti cake. It more or less just, to me, it just tastes like marshmallows, which is not bad, by the way. I, don't, I, don't, I do not mind a marshmallow uh, taste. And again, I will give it this. It at least has a taste, which the Hocus Pocus 2 cereal did not. That was a strict false advertising. Now, would I recommend it? I mean, one, it's cheap, so that, you know, that factors in a little bit. It's cheap. I would recommend it if you like a marshmallow. If you like marshmallows, you're going to love this thing, Um, because that's, again, that's what it tastes like. Would I say get it over some of my favorite cereals, like, say, Cocoa Pebbles? which Cocoa Pebbles is my favorite cereal, bar none, fight me. Uh, would I eat that over Cocoa Pebbles? Probably not, but Cocoa Pebbles is such a high bar to pass. So, I mean, I would definitely say it's worth trying at least once. If you're a fan of Disney and you want to kind of show your support for the Disney 100 and you want something that... The box alone, I mean, the box alone, it says limited edition on it. It, you know, it's going to be a collector's item. So if you want it, I would say try it. Again, I don't think you're getting straight up ripped off, like, with the Hocus Pocus 2 cereal. But, uh, again, I will be trying the other one, which is more of a fruity flavor, which is also from Post, uh, later on during the month. But for right now, again, just kind of a quick one today, uh, which, again, I think the original Hocus Pocus video was somewhat quick. Uh, but, yeah, if you guys have tried it, let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. Uh, but until tomorrow, guys, gals, and my fellow Vedzies, I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>